Hi everyone, today we are going to talk about the Beast, our latest custom build PC with the help of Noctua and Thermaltake. It runs an Intel 10900K CPU cooled by the Noctua NHD15 Chromax Black on the MSI Z490 Meg Ace. We did a video a few days ago where we showcased the processor running at 5.4 GHz in games and you asked us to show some benchmarking stress tests. So here's a video we put together showcasing the system. We tested the CPU at stock frequency 4.9 GHz and, and 4 overclock phases, 5.1 GHz, 5.2 GHz and 5.3 GHz. We recorded the videos with OBS running on the same system so the temps are 4 to 5 degrees higher and the scores are a bit lower. We also added a video running the test at 5.3 GHz with nothing on except the benchmark. So here is the CPU running at 4.9 GHz, everything stock. Remember because OBS is on, scores are a bit lower. Temperatures go up to 70 degrees in Cinebench R20 and 64 in Cinebench R15. While stressed CPU voltages go up to 1.25 volts and power consumption is up to 190 watts. Here we have the first overclock phase, 5.1 GHz, temperatures go up to 82 degrees in Cinebench R20 and 74 in Cinebench R15. While stressed, CPU voltages go up to 1.35 volts and power consumption is up to 212 watts. Thank <laughs> you. 
do here is go back 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 We reach the infamous 5.2 GHz, a point everybody is asking about the temps go wild. 100 degrees in Cinebench R20 and 95 in Cinebench R15. The sensor is a bit off, but let's bear with it. While stressed, CPU voltages go up to 1.35 volts and power consumption is up to 235 watts. We 
went a bit further to 5.3 GHz and at this point we only tested the system and Cinebench R15 temps go up to 96 degrees. Cinebench multi-core score 2665. Remember we have a bunch of other programs running in background, so we decided to test this time with the programs closed. While stressed CPU voltages go up to 1.35 volts and power consumption is up to 325 watts. So with everything closed, at 5.3 GHz the max temp is 87 degrees and the score is an amazing 2740. So the difference is around 10 degrees and the score is 70 points higher. Thanks for checking out our video. If you have any questions make sure to leave them in the comment section below and also check our other video to see the same CPU with cooler run at 5.4 GHz. See you soon.